Bosco time. All the things that you need for Bosco. your home price is so low, you will never need never. a loan at Bosco. Tell them, at Bosco. 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 Where you shopping? Appliances, household furniture and rugs, gifts and linens and glass All and mugs at Bosco. Where you shopping? At Bosco. Tell them. Where they not are so it's at the east and the west. Bosco, Bosco. them all over, they must be the best at Bosco. Where you shopping? At Bosco. Greetings guys, welcome to a very special edition of the Bashko Show. Today will not be a traditional shopping show, but today will be a very special tribute show because as most of you are aware, we have experienced the passing of our dear friend and colleague and confidant and queen of shopping, Elva. So today you're going to be hearing some tributes from a number of persons and seeing some footage over the nine years we have been doing this with the Queen. Firstly, you're going to hear from Bashko's CEO, Mr. Gassan Azan. Elva, uh, I don't even know what to say. I got a call on Sunday morning that Elva had passed away and I felt that one of my family had, had passed away. It's an extremely tragic loss. For, the, for me personally and the entire Bashko family. She was associated with us since 2009, a more jovial character I have yet to meet. And I'm at a loss for words. I, I don't even know how, how to put it. I, I'm still trying to digest her loss. And I can just imagine what her family are going through. But on the positive side, she was one of the most humorous people I knew and certainly most of Jamaica knew. And it, it cuts right to the fact that when we say Jamaicans have talent, that's what we are. We are full of talent. So Godspeed Elva and rest well. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, you started without me. You found something for me? Love it, love it, what is it? It's a full bed sheet set. My love, I come long time and stand up outside and this phone art. Watch <laughs> got AC, I come inside. The nice trapaulin. Ah, uh, tarpaulin. Okay, yes. Yeah. Run a mile, we are trapaulin, we call it, but it cover all sort of roof and car and everything. Mm. Everything there, so, me like the place there. Yeah. You know, just how the people. Everything that bash your houseware, furniture, we sort out the bedroom with seven piece comfort, I said, we're good to go, the house now going to be the same. And as for all, oh, you are going to bad man out of your neighbor <laughs> with the generator. Yeah. Bash come say. Why is Pam skin in her teeth? <laughs> I can't put it for my look at it. Hugging. Hugging. Hugging up her teeth. Okay. Okay. Hi, I'm Pam, the producer of the Bashko infomercial. I first met Elva in 2009 when we started filming the shopping show. And from then till now, they've been trying to get me in front of the camera. I don't have an addiction. That is, you know, the definition of that word is so. <laughs> well, Elva, guess what? You are the one who did it. Over the years, not only were we colleagues, but we became friends. The fiend. Take that out of it. No, keep it in. <laughs> keep it in. Keep it in. Remember, if you draw the check. <laughs> Remember, I can forge your signature. Keep it in. Elva was the epitome of life itself. Her dedication, her work ethic were second to none. Some of you are not aware, but in September, Elva was hospitalized. She convinced her doctors that they needed to release her so she could come and film this show. She came, she filmed the infomercial, went straight back to the hospital and readmitted herself. That was Elva. Nothing any of us could say at the time would convince her that she should have done otherwise. Despite everything that Elva was going through, she remained positive and upbeat. Elva always had words of encouragement and was often heard saying, you have to live your life. You is my friend. Hey! And you're the best 
girl, you're the best queen. I love girl. you, girl. Uh, 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 <laughs> Elva, queen of Bashko, you're gone. But hey, you're always in our hearts. I don't have the words to begin to express how much you will be missed. But guys, today is not a day of mourning because that is not what Elva would have wanted. Today we honor and celebrate the life of this amazing lady. Elva, on behalf of Bashko and the film crew, I want to thank you for sharing part of your life with all of us. We were not just a crew, we were family. Rest with the angels, my friend. It moves to me like, I like it. Store, I like it. I want to notice when I sweat, my proper AC everywhere. Yeah. So make we look on this one then. Oh, See, it have storage area here. Yeah. Storage area here, so you can put some nice like, figure and such. Miss some bars earlier, I think we can look on them. Yeah, so have some nice like, corners and so you're not gonna tear up yourself and them and them around yeah. it. And you know, you love walk and book up in a furniture. Yeah. You're not gonna book up on this. So. You can put some stuff in here, and you have space up on top. You can hide things from people who come here and sleep over. Yeah. I don't know when to leave. The people who don't want to go home. Yeah, I was drawn to this table. I like it. It is such a step up from the damn table where you are coming inside when you have company. I want a bashka, where is some bashka? Bashka, you're too bashka. You don't say everywhere, so you're coming like oxygen. People are being in here, you bashka. Hi, guys, I'm Athoy. I am a part of the crew, and I've worked with Elba for the past two years, and it has been an, a very interesting journey for me because I've learned a lot from her. Elva is a energy force on her own. She was always happy. She didn't need anybody to make her happy. And that is something I personally would like to have, that, that energy to keep myself happy and away from negativity. She was always about positive energy. And she told me once that as a young person, if you're doing something you're not happy doing, tap because you're not going to be successful doing it. She believed that life was there for you to live it and live it to your fullest, no matter what it is that you're doing. We miss her dearly. We miss the crazy, we miss the shopping, we miss telling her Elva no bite because you don't need it. But she is with us and she will always be in our hearts. And it looked like it could have compete to that a, a leading sound. Don't it? You know some And I have handles, so if you really want to lift it up, you can. That's what I say. You can carry go to the dance and set it up and get stolen of a run for their money. <laughs> Weep out, watch yourself. Oh. You know, suppose I get to a matches. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> we are baby. Get the price. Oh. <laughs> oh, but there's no GCT, you know, you don't need to do any calculations. Where well, you do yeah. add up if you buy three. Yeah, you're not going to get one at time. She, thank God for electronics. Members are we cater to? Hey, everybody. Young and old. Young and old. <laughs> and you in a young group. Young and old, black and white, rich and poor. Basco. Acho, thank yes. you. Go on, go shop. See it there. Sex in a brood. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I am Trish Makeup. I'm Sam Makeup. And uh, have known Elva for the past four years, actually. And whew, it's been five or six years for me. I've known Elva and worked with Elva. Elva is hilarious. <laughs> um, Elva would always make us laugh. No, thank you. I don't know it even can be adjusted. Yeah, it's it's adjustable, adjustable as well. Yeah, adjustable. Never no, I never watched it. I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't bring anything. No. Sorry. <laughs> See him, so I'm throwing away the something upstairs, you know. I didn't throw away nothing upstairs. I know, but I just said a giant in it. I feel like I need a giant in it. She always tell us this one thing, no matter what, Sam, live your life. I remember even in, in September when she was ill, 
and we try to rally around her and help her, she'd be like, yo, long man, I'm good. No need no help, man, I'm good. The way she lived her life was just full of love, joy, compassion towards people, towards everything that she does. The mere fact just simply laughing was like a medicine to her. She loved us dearly. She loved people dearly. She gave up herself. She was like really selfless. Elva, everybody love you. Like, ma, it hurts to not have you here. But remember this, we all love you. You're in our heart. You now leave, trust me. What good Elva. Elva, rest in peace, darling. Really miss you. All of us at Bashko really miss you, but we know that you're in a better place and that we love you dearly. You'll always be in our heart. Rest in peace, Queen Elva. Queen for Bashko, we we'll love you same way, baby. For come home in the evening and see me leave the partner with my clothes and my beard and my stuff, and then I'm coming to the room and I have this plug in and I bubble up and eat it. I'm going to take off your shoes, stinky and put them in this and wash it and stroke it and rub it on that personal touch ladies that personal touch goes a long long way yeah personal touch you know pay somebody for doing anybody can pay for have something done but when you actually go down and do it yourself with them tough ugly can foot you know man foot ugly it shows that you love him turn on your back let me see if this can fit you because that's smart see it there just tuck in your belly and i use that yeah, man, but it's for you. I want to have it here. Wait, Bubba, Barry will come. Bubba, get new shoes, but just a seat. Bubba, the light tech, you know. Heal to the L. Ever living, ever loving. Elva. Yeah, are the, are the queen. Anyone get a pinch off of Elva, get a pinch off of love. Reality. <laughs> Stop hitting me! You see him hit me? Bubba! 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 We're gonna be Okay. <laughs> oh, I don't oh, no. Yo, Elva. Long live here, man. Cause I don't matter about gone. You know you're there. You know you're there. Yeah, you feel the energy. No sorrow to it, think. Cause that's all you tell, Bubba. No, no weakness, no forget, yo. E to the L. Ever living, ever loving, Elva, the queen of shopping. So that's the I love. Bless it. Where's she gone? Oh, I push I just... You guys didn't see where the queen went? The queen no. is right here. Queen! Hi. What? What are you doing? No, no. I wasn't doing anything. Why well, don't get I up and come make us no, look for the store? I'm still working. Yeah. I came to look at these mats. That's Which what we have a lot of in here. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I see. I yeah. was checking out the mats, checking yeah. out the time, making out sure everything is So we yeah. have the gazebos and everything. Let me tell you something, gentlemen. Get this for your lady. It's $300. Remember, little tokens go a long way. And if you have no one bag of money, I'm buying a jewelry and a diamond there forever. Forget that. This, $300, she will love you. Trust me. Or this one for just $450. See, they're even better. For, uh, well, you know about to care of woman. Them look something here. Yeah. And them look something yeah, keep romance jiggy. What is this? Hold your horses and keep yourself quiet. Okay. I never saw the hello limb on the broom near moment. Stainless steel torch. Or stainless steel. And you know what I like? Don't jump me with something. It comes <laughs> with a spike. So I don't have to be bludgeoning the earth to get it in it just you know is anyone else very nervous about the concept of the queen let me let me hold. i'll go this way <laughs> elva was a jovial person there was never a dull moment around her um she always said to us push p-u-s-h push until something happens we should never give up in the fight. It's all about a fight. But we should hold on. Never give up. But to the family, I will always say, ride out your storm. Your answer is coming in the morning. Just hold on to Jesus and ride out your storm. Rest in peace, Elva. When you're here, it was always a joy to have you around. And it's always a bubbly moment with you, never a dull moment. 
And I'll, say, I'll encourage your family to hold on. And God knows best. Sleep in peace, Elva. Guys, when you come, be sure to check with the people working here what color is in the box yes, before you buy it. Correct. And don't be opening every single box. Right. Just ask us, Maddie. We'll gladly Thank help you. you. For sure. Because when the box pull up, it don't look good when me come by it and it looks chaka chaka. Good. You know why nothing chaka chaka? You know, chaka? it's true. People, people yeah. make that, you know, they come here. Um, <clears throat> and any idiot, I mean, me can do it. Can I do it by myself? No. Tools. Okay. Missy, you, missy, you know. Yeah. yeah. The whole world I see you too. No, all the world. Well, me, me see you on the TV. Me can't. Me not. Me ask you and him. All right. You lick him and him and lick you and I'm yeah. gonna play. So me there now. Today I you know. All so right. me I go see myself on the TV. Yeah. And yeah. Know. Looking and at the TV. Yes. Yeah. 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 Touch, respect girl, our touch, manners. Touch, respect touch. our manners. All right. Ah, right. true. Me a buy. Yeah. We see that. <laughs> like our energy. <laughs> Glory. Okay. Ooh. Praise him. Yes. <laughs> Thank God for editing. It's the eye of the tiger. It's the tree of the fight. Rising up to the challenge of survival. And the last note of survival stalks is praying in the night. And it's dodging us all with the eyes of the tiger. Work it. She wouldn't want us to be sad. She do want the work to continue on, so my condolences to our family. Love Elva forever. Manners and respect still, you know, but Elma come like a, a sister, a brother, everything now on. So no when she gone, you come like me, you can't do so we're comfortable. So Elma, just bless up yourself. You hear that crooks you always remember you. No matter what, you thick and thin. I bless you up for the rest of my friend them still. And you are the first lady to make me go up on the video. You come in and like video. But I true of you make me have to talk on this right now. Because I know when I'm there, so today I'm not see you, today I feel a way. And I tell you straight, hmm? but bless you up still, because I can't go no more. I feel like you're not care when I talk. I'm sorry for her loss and everything, but it's a great girl that's working here. I can tell you that much about her. Yeah, she do her work to the standard. Big up to Elva, pass and gone. One thing I can say for sure, Elva is a person who dedicates her life to make other people happy. Because when you're, you're, you're sick, and most people don't even know say you're sick, when you come, you make everybody else happy. You know, burden them with your burden. You understand? That is a life worth living and a life well lived, just to make other people happy. A life worth living. That's all I can say about Elva. People think of travel like them, have to go to an airport. Not necessarily. Not necessarily. You have weekends you can go, spend with your family. Not because it's your family, guys, or because you're going by a friend. It means say, if I pack up a sitting there in one drawstring bag or one scandal bag, no, no. Invest in luggage. Nice, attractive luggage. So even if you go, oh no, no, oh neighbor fast, but break it down too now. All if you not go now, all if you go to a supermarket, carry this and pack your grocery them in it. Make your neighbor them one day for far in your go. So step out. Walk I look better than in a real life, don't. Yeah, it's more than previous. I don't ugly man, they angle the camera. So <laughs> 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 no, Elva. No. Are we ready? <laughs> uh. Elva, I don't even know where to start, you know, because Elva represent life. Elva represent just making people who comes in our space, full of energy, full of just you can't come to Elva space with no negative energy. It's in a room for bone if you're negative. You know what I mean? And working with Elva, becoming her friend. You know what I mean? I remember the very first time when I approached her to come to TV. I'm Rupert Campbell, the camera and director behind all of this. Um, to come to TV, help her run me. I said, Yeah, your camera ain't sure. So your camera work. You want to mash it up? I said, No, Elva, we want you for TV. And eventually she came and she made a big impact into everybody's life. You know what I mean? Everybody life. Everybody who has energy. You, you feel down here, come on, Elva. You have your vibes. Your, your spirit change. You know what I mean? And 
the world, not just Jamaica, the world miss a beautiful soul, you know what I mean? A soul that represents life. Because if you think like Eleva, the woman was dying and she was aware of it. And she lived beyond that. Nobody is making flower dumplings for God. It's not just for flower kneading. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the team of Boschko that Eleva is a part of, the film crew, we are a family. Elva come like one of the big sister. She never ran for box in the head back and tells her, I want you. She's very honest, straightforward, you know what I mean? And it means a lot to me to even stand there to just honor the woman, you know what I mean? To have her in my space, to have her be a part of my life and be a part of my journey, you know what I mean? And I'm just gonna celebrate and give thanks, you know what I mean? Family, trust me. History create. Elva left out in the hospital and come to shoot Basca show. In that, you know what I mean, in her pain and her agony and her discomfort, she came and did it and went back to the hospital. It is serious. Her family is important. You, the viewers, are important to her. You know what I mean? It wasn't about Elva and her pain and her sickness. She lived every moment and rinsed it out. One life, Bridget, just live, brother. Elva, think that just live and love straight. Now, every year, Bashka tries to outdo itself with tree, right? You know, so we have the best soul stacker, the most variety, and the best person one at home. <laughs> Why did I go there with that a while ago? I have no, <laughs> Even the damn girls stand up. What's going on? At Christmas, love me, me live my life. Elva, you are the best thing ever I'm for Bashka, trust me. You understand? You are the best thing. And for the nine years, I watch you out of the show. I tell you, I always have to laugh. And I tell you, you are my icon. Ever, enough love, respect. If, if the soup was suitcase, every favor for you, I right, reach my idea. <laughs> And you're so happy, because you come off of the plane and you're tired and you just wait by the turnstile. You can't wait for your suitcase and the first bag of fever for you, you come and you struggle and you take it off and you take it off. You go, I know my <laughs> Jesus <laughs> wept. <laughs> After you don't tear out your back and somebody have them breadfruit, one suitcase full of breadfruit. Me know her, me feel it. <laughs> because after me take it off, me smell the roasters. <laughs> I say, my my. My name is Neil Grant, store manager. Um, just want to send a tribute to Elva Ruddock, you know, one of our, I would say, sister. I'll tell you something, I don't have it like she. <laughs> so first and foremost, one wonder if I can talk to you off the ear about give me a little credit. Uh. Well, we don't have to talk off the ear, you know. Oh, for real? We don't. You know, I mean, I've been here for many years and, you know, when I met, first met Elva, I mean, she was just full of life, bubbly, always jovial. I always leave a conversation with her laughing. And I mean, I tell you, we, we will miss her very, very much. So are you going in there? We just can't carry you anywhere. You want me to hold the microphone for you? Yeah. Now, this is very important. Trained operator must be on duty at all times. Oh, good. We have the microphone being held here. So I'm going to ask all the kids to hold on one minute for me because you're about to be treated to royalty. I wish we could have like a theme song. She's going to enter the bounce boat, where she will bounce a boat. No, I'm not going to bounce, you because you know. National <laughs> party, we're sorry, but for those of us who are. I'm not going to bounce. I bet you I'm not going to bounce. Watch me, I don't know. Oh, I'm so happy. She brought me another one. Hold on, this is where I go through? Yes. Well, I'm going to put on back my shoes right now. Discrimination right now. I that me, I said. I'm going to fight against the youth. Are you the operator? <laughs> it says you're a trained operator. Yes, ma'am. No, they, they, all right. Um, you want to switch? Injustice has been meted out onto my body size. <laughs> I don't think it's fair unto me. Have a because snowboard. Because I am a chubby children. All right. The opening is for a hundred size children. Who <laughs> fired bigger? Look for where we go. Who fired bigger? Can him keep a call me bigger than who fired bigger? <laughs> She says you have to take off your wig for me to look by your inside. <laughs> <laughs> All right, may I take the title then? May I take the big head title then? Oh my, you win. Hi there. I'm Fred Danger. This is my associate. Hell of a stranger. Come on. 
<laughs> I don't know. You never tell me so where I go with nicknames. <laughs> but that didn't work. Is it chair and the light and the stuff, you know? All right, go on again. All right. Hi there, I'm Fred Danger. And I'm Hero Duck. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. You don't have to panic. That's right. There is no need to alarm. We go through this every single year. Right. It can't be that you rush the supermarket and then you hear another storm is coming and you rush in the supermarket again. Oh, well, yeah, I'm so. <laughs> Where are all the candles? You ate them? Every time we go with Cooper Crepe. No, one scrape for the hurricane season. Put them down. You bought them because of an emergency. If the emergency did not happen, left them right there, sir. All right, guys, so you have seen the evolution of what we had done for the last nine years with the Queen, and you have spoken to, because that's what we're calling that, we're speaking to you, uh, a number of the behind the scenes crew. Guys, you've always heard us talk about, but never maybe had a chance to see. You even saw Pam, our producer, who for nine years, Elva was trying to get her on screen and Elva finally managed to do it. So thank you for being on this Bashko show. And before you go, it's time for me to tell you guys how I feel about the whole thing. Hey, hey Queenie. This is hard for me. Um, nine years I've been doing this and we've been learning from each other. And it is very hard to put into words that entire experience. How do you put nine years of experience into a couple minutes of, how do you feel, Omar? Let's look at something over here. Over here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, man, I can't bother with you, dude. Exit stage, exit stage left, into right into the umbrella. Uh, I feel so good. I feel amazing because I've been doing this marketing thing for a while and business for a longer time. And at the same time, I learned more in nine years from the Queen than you should possibly have learned about doing things. I remember when I started this at our, one of our first bachelor parties. Elva, you literally pulled a customer off of me and said to her, look at girl, you know, city man can't manage that. <laughs> and to your own admission years later, to say, Omar, you've come such a long way. Uh, I got some amazing nicknames. Um, head smudge, which is a, a long joke about the first time I shaved my head and we were in a vehicle. And Elva literally filmed me laughing because as I slipped my head on the glass of the inside, I smudged up the whole side of the people them van. And, um, Elva also used to make an effort to come to my music shows and cheer at the top of her lungs in this crowd. And a bit of a funny story, when I got married, Elva told me categorically, do not invite me to your wedding. And I said, what do you mean don't invite you, Elva? She said, because I'm going to find two people pick me and I'm going to come at the wedding. When the pastor says, does anyone have any reason why these two shall not be wed? And you said to me, mega come down the aisle of ball. Omar, what are you doing, sir? No, Omar, with the two pick me. So I did not invite you to my wedding. And, um, but my entire life, my, my friendships, my work relationships, how I relate to Jamaican people, how I learned Jamaican culture, a lot of that was through you, Elva. It is an experience I treasure. It is life lessons that you imparted to me in how to live, how to be honest and be yourself and enjoy that despite what anybody else has to say about it. And that's what I take from it. So people ask me, how you feel, Omar? Yes, I will miss you, Elva. Hero Duck, I will miss you in ways I don't know how to say, but I am so blessed that I got to meet and know and work with you. So that's our show again, guys. We will see you every other time. Next time, we will have all of you in our thoughts and prayers as we know we are in yours. Thank you. So she says to me, what's your name? So I go, Hero Duck. Like, does it matter? She says, pardon me? Hero Duck. So she gave me the receipt and I snatch it and gone. It wasn't until days later and I may do my receipt filing and thing. I may open it, I see really? H E R O D U C K. No. Appear at Gal Dem Shop Babasco. Appear at Man Cup Shop Babasco. You want to know the goodness Shop Babasco. Dog Babasco. Hey! Walk on, goody, walk on! Hey. Bashko time. All the things that you need for show. The price is so low, you will never need yeah. a loan at Bashko. Tell it at Bashko. Bash, where you shopping? Appliances, household furniture, and rugs, beefs and linens and glass All and mugs at Bashko. Where you shopping? At Bashko. Tell it. Where you're in Nata, so it's at the east and the west. Everywhere. Show them all over, they must be the best at Bashko. Where you shopping? At Bashko. Tell them again. At Bashko. At Bashko. At Bashko.
more.